Oh, my campies. Okay, I hope that the people who are having birthdays are also here to see the energy vibration of this reading because it's um, very important. Okay, you campies. Oh, my. OMG. OMG, you campies. Look at this. Look at this, campies. Look at this, my campies. Okay, so Capricorn, here you go. The energy vibration of your year for the people who are having birthdays between the 14 and the 20th. Their energy vibration was the energy of the tower. Now, ladies and gentlemen, especially for the people who was on the 14 who has the energy of the hermit, there is a new start that is about to come in for you, Capis. Okay, so this is your weekly energy. So remember, the people who were born on the 14 got the hermit. Um, with the tower for the year okay so remember who are you were you born on the 14th of January um, the energy of your um, year is going to be the energy of the tower and for 14 and this is a general reading okay so be aware of this ladies and gentlemen this is a general reading if you'd like a personalized reading to see what is going to happen um, something good is going to happen for the people who are born on the 14th because here is your energy vibration from the hermit coming back and some good news is going to be coming in a new start is going to be coming for you people so this is a message for someone out there who was born on the 14th of January um, let's do this again so you can see and um, there's some good news that is going to be coming in in this week for you okay and you're seeing the truth of a situation and some good news is coming in for you guys so if you were born on the 14th of um, January some good news is about to come in for the cappies because of your energy of the year is the tower you're seeing something for the truth of it and there's a new start that is about to begin for you cappies okay so this was a message for someone who was born on the 14th okay wonderful wonderful news um for uh, someone who was born on the 14th and it's just that you're seeing the truth of a situation something that has happened the cap is who were born on the 14th because this was the energy of the people who were born on the 14th of january and a new start okay so so for some of you campies um <clears throat> we're looking we're looking at what is transpiring and what is happening so let's see so what we have some of you are dealing with a Pisces cancer a Pisces cancer or um, a scorpion um, I'm seeing money coming in for some of you um, campies I'm seeing that some of you campies are seeing the truth of a situation that has transpired I'm seeing that some of you campies have been carried a burden and it has to do with a kid um, this could be your son this could be um, someone you are in relationship with the Pisces cancer or scorpion um, there is the situation where people are in relationship with a Pisces cancer or the scorpion there is definitely a situation that is transpiring because these people are all in your reading what I love about your weekend is that your weekend is strong stable is coming in um, some good news your wheel of fortune and you're victorious you have victoriously come out of a situation so this is a good good week for you campus you campus are going to be having a good week these are positive energies you have one of the best energy when it's in reverse is that you're seeing the truth to a situation so this is good some good news is about to come in wheel of fortune is here and you're going to be triumphant over a situation that to do with um, um, a Pisces cancer or a scorpion um, this is a young man whoever this young man is he has been very honest the older man is more positive and honest but this young man is not really honest and you're going to be um, he has created so much burden in your life and you're seeing the truth about this young man and what he has done and what he has created in your life and and you are going to be um, definitely cutting out this young man. He's a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion. It could be your partner, or it could be um, your child. But whoever he is, is not a very 
um, honest person, okay? Um, you're seeing the truth about this young man now. Okay, so let's look and see what the King of Cups is coming up with because this King of Cups is really positive. So let's see what the King of Cups is offering you. The King of Cups is going to be telling you something, okay? The King of Cups is going to be um, bringing you some message about money, okay? And this is good. Let's see what's happening with the Nine of Pentacles. Wonderful, wonderful opportunities is going to be coming in. And some of you are going to be moving away and move forward. And this is going to be good, okay? Um, what message? What are you going to finally see the truth of? The Wheel of Fortune is here. Damn, copies. You, Capis, are having a wonderful, wonderful week. And Caps. Oh my God, this is really, really a wonderful week for you, Capis. So, so, what is the burden that is coming up? Yeah, it's the last of your zodiac energy vibration, also. So, I guess from there. What is the burden that you Capis are going to be dealing with? What is the burden? The burden of um, money coming in. So it's going to be releasing your burden. So some money will be coming in. That is going to be releasing your burden. Okay. What are you going to be finding out about this Knight of um, Cups? Whoever this Knight of Cups is, is not a good person. You're going to be victorious over whatever he had thrown at you okay this knight of cups is could be a son could be a friend it could be someone on the work floor but whatever burdens that he has thrown to you you're going to be receiving the funds to get out of it and cut him off and walk away okay nine of a pentacles okay so some of you um it could be a child that it's all about money for this child, okay? And you're finding this out, and you're going to be releasing yourself from this child because it's all about money. Um, there, every time it's all about money, and you're going to just release yourself, um, from this child. And whatever is happening in this week, you Capis are going to be receiving some money. Nine of Pentacles up right here. Nine here. Nine. Um, this is 99 so end of a situation is going to be happening an end of a situation in some of you lives um, the end of burdensome situation is going to be coming to an end the end of negative energies with certain people that you have been dealing with whatever the situation is is that an end has come now for the, the behavior of this person whoever this person is because it is his drive was only about money okay his drive was only about money whether he, you're in a relationship with him or what his drive was only about money and it's as if you know the universe come in and said you know you know end the shit whatever it is um this person is being very deceptive his drive was only about money now, some of you, um, someone who is a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion, or older woman, could have to be paying you some money. Okay, whoever the Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion is, um, she has to pay you some money. It could be a Scorpion, or it could be a Cancer. But whoever this woman is, she has to pay you some money because she has done something that was injustice. And here is the energy of, you know, this message of this news is going to be coming in this week. It's a karmatic situa situation that has, has transpired. And whoever she is, she's sad. And she's sad because her, um, whatever she has done, um, um, you know, a couple of years ago, came back and bite her in, bite her. And what this is showing is that karma karma people karma be careful what you do karma karma so there's a lady that is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion she has done something she's saddened because she has to pay you some money to release you from on the dust burden she has to repay you some money because she has done something that is injustice and she has to repay you some money okay let's see what message this Knight of Cups is going to be bringing to you? Um, this Knight of Cups is going to be bringing you some positive, positive, positive news. It's going to be coming in for this Knight of Cup. And what is happening also is that um, with the money, some of you are going to be receiving um, some money. Um, it could be someone who 
um, cares about you this person is going to be um, bringing you some financial abundance see I'm seeing um, this happening for you wheel of fortune it's gonna be a wonderful week what are you seeing because the wheel of fortune is coming up and showing you something and this is about a friend okay you're seeing the truth about a friend and a situation okay you're really seeing the truth about a friend and a situation so whatever that was transpiring and whoever this friend is now whoever you're dealing with um, this um, Queen of Cups pain um, to release your burden okay oh you're going to be overcoming a situation and this is just so because you're successful and whatever is happening with these um because this lady um, has been coming up and this lady has a situation it's as if she was a friend or she has done something in the past injustice against you and she has to pay you some money Wow she has to pay you some money okay so we're looking at the um, Wow okay and this is what I said to people if you can't do something good don't do something bad because it's gonna be um, it's going to be turning around on you Queen of Cups yeah you're gonna be successful because whatever this Queen of Cups did to you uh, she has to pay you some money um, and that is going to be releasing your burdens now Knight of Cups whoever this Knight of Cups is there's some money all he wants is money release this person out of your life uh, Knight of Wands oh and this Knight of Cups, whoever they are, is a child. I did say that, and here is the energy of a child, because I did say it, and then it came back out. This Knight of Cups is the energy of a child, and all he wants is money. The only thing that drives him, it is the money. Let him go. Remove him out of your life. You really, really don't need this person in your life, okay? Because whoever he is, he is driven um, by money. And um, some of you are going to be standing up and said, no, I'm not doing that. You know, um, you're driven by money if that's um, the only thing that drives you by. Okay, some of you have a karmatic situation with the, the Knight of um, Rods, whoever this Knight of Rods is, you're having a karmatic situation with this Knight of Rods. Okay, and um, uh, this is someone who you're going to be connecting with. Okay, so some of you on Saturday. Um, could be meeting someone who is um damn damn <laughs> okay I okay all right I don't know if this message is for someone who was born on the 14th of January but girl um this night of ones that you're going to be meeting on Saturday damn girl that um, you guys are going to be connecting and uh, a ring is there which mean and connecting in business this person could be connected in business with you but it also could be the start of a new relationship so whoever uh, and it's gonna bring money because he's going to be helping you he's gonna be connecting with you and bring you somehow this connection with this knight of rod whoever he is um some of you are going to be meeting this man on saturday whether it's through business or it's uh, whoever this man is listen this man is going to make you make some money or you're going to connect it could be a marriage that is coming also up okay and um the last um message i'm having here is for some of you are going to overcome a situation that you have deal with with a work situation where some lies and injustice um, that has transpire and do not take it as it is in the order because it could be affecting you in different ways I'm loving your week um, you kept it it is really looking good whoever is meeting a man in the weekend you could end up marrying this man okay so whoever is meeting a man that is in it's not an Aries it's more a Leo of a Saji um, you're gonna end up marrying this man okay you're really because here the ring and the man you're gonna end up marrying this man so um, if you're having birthdays and you're celebrating your birthdays there's someone someone is going to be meeting 
this man on Saturday because um, it doesn't have to be a Saturday. You could be meeting this man in a week. And what is transpiring here is that you could end up marrying this man. Damn, girl. <laughs> All right, let's see what else is coming out. Wonderful week, Capis. I do whatever it takes to get closer to consciousness. I do whatever it takes to get close to consciousness. I do whatever it takes to get close to consciousness okay damn girls ladies and gentlemen I'm loving this week oh there's a message for the men the message for the men is um, your, your business or um, whatever your business is uh, you men are going to be um, your business if you you men are businessmen it's going to be a wonderful week for you guys okay um, here is the energy of a wonderful week that is coming up for you guys so it's just going to be wonderful it's just going to be positive good situation is about to come I love you Capis I gotta go I'm always over time and I love you guys enjoy your week it's gonna be a powerful week namaste yeah.